Hi everyone, I'm Krista and welcome to my video on the healing benefits of candle quartz. Candle quartz is a beautiful gemstone that is easy to find in shops as well as shops online and it comes in two different colors. It can be a nice white type of quartz or one that has a pink tinge to it. So the specimen that I want to show you is one that has a little bit of pink. Okay. So candle quartz is called candle quartz because it almost looks like a melting candle. It looks like there's wax. So here, it's a little bit hard to see maybe in this camera, but there's all these little points here that are all around this crystal and it looks like dripping wax down this way. And as you can see, this top area here, it's got the pink color. So I'll hold it a little closer so that you can see it. Okay, there we go. You can see it quite nicely. And what I love about candle quartz is that it's a really beautiful stone to remind you of your own inner light. So if you feel that you're having a bit of a stressed out time in life, or you're feeling some depression, or sadness or despair, then this stone can help clear those emotions from you and help you to heal and heal from those stressful situations and circumstances and help you to have and hold more light. And when you hold more light in your energy or holding a lighter mood or holding more light in your aura, then you radiate that beautiful good energy into everything that you do and every situation that you're in and every interaction that you have with another person. So it helps to remind you to shine that light into the world and to be that beacon of light. It can also help to show you that when you are having times of stress in your life and you're feeling some despair, working with this crystal and carrying it with you can help to remind you that there is light at the end of the tunnel. Or another way I could say it is, remember when we have stormy weather and if there's dark storm clouds in the sky and there's rain, the sun will shine again. So this crystal really helps to remind you of that. It will help you to give you strength through those times of stress and darkness so that you can return back into the light. And just know that sometimes in life, you know, we go through different cycles and when there's a cycle of stress, the stone reminds you that there will also be a period of light. So it can really help to cleanse those negative emotions from you and dark moods from you. Now, this stone is also really good for group energy. So if you work in a group of any kind, whether that is uh, within a classroom or a study group or a speaking group, any type of group work, you could bring this stone and have it in the center of the room as your group is gathering. And it will help to bring light to the group and it will also help to harmonize group energies of each individual in the group so that everyone can work together for the common good or for a common goal. Now sometimes in groups there can be differences of opinion or different personality conflicts that can arise and sometimes that can lead to conflicts overall or sometimes irritation or anger or sometimes people in group energy can get into arguments. It can happen. So when you work with the stone, you can actually help to have the stone in the room to harmonize that group energy and to let go of those conflicts and help the group to heal so that everyone can work together in a more harmonious way. So what you can do is you can take your candle quartz and before you're going to gather with the group, you can hold it in your hand and it's really nice to speak an intention to the stone and thank the stone for its healing work. So you can just close your eyes and take a nice deep breath in and exhale. And you can say to the stone, thank you candle quartz for helping to harmonize group energy so that everyone can get along and work together for the highest good of all and towards our common goal. In full faith, so be it. Okay, so once you set that intention to the stone, 
then put it in the room when the group gathers and let it just radiate that beautiful healing energy and light and cooperation out into the room so that everyone can benefit. So that is a really nice way to work with the stone. Now, um, also, if you want to cleanse just some negative emotions that you are feeling or holding, if it's a little bit of depression or despair or you've lost hope, in the situation that you might be in that could be stressful or if you have also been burned by someone in the past where someone has betrayed you and you're feeling a lack of trust then the stone can also help to clear that so i'll show you a little technique that is very simple yet very powerful that can help cleanse those negative emotions from you or just cleansing the past situation so that you can heal from it and move forward now because this candle quartz has pink in it it is a really nice stone that harmonizes with the heart center and the heart chakra. So what you want to do is, again, speak an intention to the stone. So an intention is like this, and I'm just giving you some examples of what an intention can be, but please feel free to word the intention any way that you like and speaking those words from your heart, okay? So I'm just giving you an example of this. So holding the stone, closing your eyes, taking a nice deep breath in, and exhale and you can say to the stone thank you candle quartz for helping to release all negative emotions of anger sadness despair or mistrust helping me to heal from the past so that I can be uplifted to hold more light and more positive energy and to uplift my mood in full faith so be it Okay, so now what you want to do is hold the crystal to your heart, your heart center, right in the center of your chest. And then what you can imagine, just close your eyes and just imagine that the beautiful candle quartz is radiating beautiful pink healing light into your heart chakra, which your heart chakra is actually the color green right in the center of your chest, that energy center is green. So just imagine all of that beautiful pink light flowing into your green heart chakra and dissolving any negative emotions that are there. You might see those negative emotions like little dark spots of gray fog or dark energy and just imagine that the pink light is flowing into those areas of dark energy, dissolving it and strengthening your heart chakra so that you can hold more light, more love, more happiness, joy, and to be at peace. And just sense or feel or see your heart chakra strengthening. And if you have been betrayed by someone in the past, then just imagine that your heart chakra is strengthening so that you can trust. Trusting yourself or trusting once again or trusting in love or trusting in friendships. And when you hold that higher vibration, then you can actually attract beautiful situations to you and people that are there that are loving and trustworthy and supportive. So you just imagine all of that pink light flowing from the stone into your heart ch chakra, strengthening that heart chakra. And then when you feel the process is complete, you can then carry the stone with you throughout the day so that you can stay in that high vibration. So that's a nice way to do it. Now, another great aspect to candle quartz is that it can also enhance intuition and personal illumination, especially when you meditate. So it really helps you to open up to your own inner truth. If you ever feel a little bit low in life where you're not sure what your life purpose is or what kind of career path you should take, or sometimes you feel that you might have thoughts about what am I you know, here to do in this world and what's my contribution to other people or situations or the world, the candle quartz, when you meditate with it, can help you to get those answers, which is really, really nice. So it can help you to connect to your higher self, your own inner truth, your own inner wisdom and answer those questions for you. So the way that you can do this, again, you can state a powerful intention before you meditate. And uh, because candle quartz brings more light, if 
if you want to do a meditation, it might be a nice idea to consider lighting a candle when you do this meditation, just again to radiate that light. So you can take your candle quartz and you can hold it before you meditate. And you can say to the candle quartz, thank you so much for opening my intuition and helping me to connect to my higher self and to my own inner truth and wisdom so that I can see what my purpose is or what my next career path is or what direction I should take in life with clarity so that I can see this for my highest good in full faith, so be it. You can also ask the candle quartz to show you any hidden talents or abilities that you might have as well. So then once you have stated your intention, you can just sit comfortably and hold your stone and just close your eyes and just let your mind become peaceful and still. And those answers can pop up into your mind while you do the meditation or even in the days following the meditation, you might have dreams where the answer comes to you, or the answer could come to you even in the daytime with different insights that you might have that just flash into your mind, or conversations that you have with people where all of a sudden a piece of information that's spoken is wisdom for you. So it can show up even in synchronistic events as well. So there's many ways that that insight can show up when you work with the crystal in the meditation. It sets the ball in motion for those flashes of insight to come however they come, whether it's flashes in the mind or through the dream state or synchronicities. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Krista, crystal healing therapist as well as teacher of crystal healing classes. If you would like more information on crystals and crystal classes, then please visit my website at kristalin.ca or you can also like my Facebook page. Thank you so much for watching. Blessings to you and namaste.